Her name was Miss Graffio, and she was my sixth grade history teacher. And the funny thing is, is I don't like history. <laughs> my favorite teacher I've ever had is Miss Muncher from Oxford High School. She was my 12th grade psychology teacher. Miss mm, Norwood, fourth grade. <sighs> Probably Miss Pav uh, at Morris Area High School, in Minnesota. Oh, my favorite teacher is Gloria Morris. Um, she was my kindergarten teacher, and I actually have a picture of the both of us in my classroom currently. Miss McLeod, my 10th grade English teacher. Favorite teacher that I've ever had was probably Miss Miller at Leeds Elementary in fifth grade. My favorite teacher was my band director, Doc. His name was Dr. Barry Bredwell. The best teacher I ever had was Mr. Lonnie Marbury. He was my most favorite teacher in the whole wide world. My favorite teacher was my third grade teacher, Miss Hobby. <laughs> she, uh, she, she was one of those that understood her calling, that saw past my rough upbringing and saw not who I was, but who I could be. Uh, and I think that's because she's connected with who she uh, knows that she was. But she made it very captivating and it was very hands-on and she loved us very much. Oh, she, she was just awesome. Um, made you really want to learn every day you went to her classroom. Uh, she made those personal connections. She was, she was more than a teacher. She was sort of like a mother um, for, you know, all of our students. Um, she's the reason why I became an English teacher. Um, I think I became a really good writer because of her, um, and she definitely challenged the way I thought about the world and how I understood things around me. And um, I loved her so much because she took an interest in us indiv as individuals. We were people to her and we meant something to her. Um, he helped me see that I could be good in more things than just academics. He helped me find my tribe. Um, like I said, once a band nerd, always a band nerd. She is what inspired me to instill that love of reading. And um, she stood by me on my wedding day. She's been there when my kids were born. So a teacher is not just for a season to me. It's not just for a, a calendar year or a school year. I feel like the relationships that you instill with your kids last for a lifetime. A good teacher is someone who teaches you knowledge and, and tells you stuff that you need to learn. A good teacher is someone who inspires, supports, and motivates their students to, to the best of their knowledge. They're there for their students. They help them grow and become better. They help them find their future. A good teacher has the ability to create relationships and make connections. A good teacher gives me, give me a new chance every day. A good teacher to me is someone who cares about me and they help me whenever I need help. A good teacher meets students where they are, uh, whether it's academically, socially, emotionally, the, the teacher's able to identify what those needs are and, and really just ad adapt to that uh, and support that student. A good teacher is kind and friendly. A good teacher is good because they teach us stuff and they want us to make people go to different grades and get good grades so we could go to college, get a girlfriend, make a house, and things. Um, a good teacher is, uh, I would call them a mentor. A good teacher always helps their students uh, with whatever they need to learn. Um, I think a good teacher is someone who sort of guides you and is able to talk to you on a, like not on the basis of just a teacher, but like as an actual person and like you can have down to earth conversations with. If you could tell Miss Norwood anything in the whole wide world, what would you tell Miss Norwood? Thank you for loving me unconditionally. I would tell Miss Morris that I love her. I tell her that I love her. I told her that I love her so much. Oh, that I love her so much. Like, you're great. Like, keep being you, girl. <laughs> I would tell her that I love her and that I'm super grateful for um, just the things that she's taught me. And I'm jealous of all the students that are going to be in her class this year. 
I'll tell her thanks for giving me knowledge. Um, thank you for loving me so well in one of the hardest seasons of my life as a child. Thank you for caring about me and every other student who enters your classroom on a daily basis.